Yo, what's up guys? As you can tell by the title, the title of the video. So basically, this is the story to my, the dumbest thing I have ever done. Do not do anything, anything you hear in this video. Okay, it hurt, it hurt a lot. Okay, um, but anyways, um, so yeah. So, in a different video, I talked about this uh, haunted cabin. It was another story time. And it's actually in the same exact playlist. It's called... I forgot what it's... I forgot what they called it. But, um, it revolves around this mount, this cabin on a mountain called Mount Hood. And it's the same place. So, basically... I had a few older friends when I was, like, 11. That could... That were, like, 15... And me, my friend, my friend's older brother, and some girls decided to go up and just go sledding. And this guy had, and my friend's older brother had a cabin. And we were just going to go up there and just stay for a couple days and play in the snow. And anyways, we go up there. Long drive up. Um, but anyways... We start drinking. I don't know why we started drinking. I wasn't, cause uh, <clears throat> I like to be able to think. Yes. Oh, by the way, did you? This is probably gonna be age restricted, but did you know that if you shove a tampon up your ass, and if you put any alcohol in it, and you shove it up your ass, you'll actually get um drunk very, very quickly. Oh wait, crap. This is gonna get demonetized. And sadly, the story does not involve Niels, even though yes, he is in the gameplay. Oh, by the way, Niels, since you finally... Anyways, um... Um... Bugga Bugga, Niels' channel, he did, he hasn't uploaded any videos, so I should probably tell him how to when he gets up. Because I'm currently recording this at, like, 3 a.m. right now. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna tell him how he, when he gets up. And, uh, yeah, um... But basically... <coughs> since, like... I don't know, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Basically, we start drinking, and we start sledding. If you don't know, this really crazy thing called, um, physics works. Okay, when you drink something, like, that gets you, that doesn't allow you to be in control of your body, you, and really, really fast things, equals two things. Either one, things come up and they don't taste as well. Or two, the same thing, but even worse. So somehow we didn't manage to all throw up. But, um, we start sledding, and we find this garbage pile. And this lazy boy, and you know those lazy boys that have the spinny chair things on the bottom? Yeah, so we decide, and I used to get a crap ton inside when my, uh, my uh, wheels came off of my board a couple, like a month or two ago while I was doing a kickflip on a rail. I still have the deck, but the wheels just came off because apparently I am really good at skating. I am because I play a shit ton of Skate 3. Um... Oh, since because I skate a lot, I won't, I can't get hurt. <clears throat> yes, I know how to fall better. I really do. It's like, it's like in football. You know how to get tackled. And if you skateboard a lot, you know how to get, you know how to fall. So because apparently I skateboard a lot, I can't get hurt. <laughs> oh my God. And so he shows us the, like, my friend's older brother shows us this video of this guy lighting it on fire and going down a hill. <clears throat> I forgot to mention, he doused it in, like, 15 gallons of gasoline. <laughs> do not do that. Do not, do not do. Like I said at the beginning of this video, do not do anything you see or hear in this video. Okay, I will get age-restricted, and I'll probably give this channel straight. I I just need three channel strikes just to get uh kicked off of YouTube. <laughs> that would not be fun. Anyways, uh, what was this in? Oh yeah. So basically, so anyways, we bring it up. He shows us the video, like I said, and he and he starts saying, "Oh, we should do that." And I'm like, "No, no, no, no." And they force me onto it. They strap me down with like a couple belts. And um, what's this in? Oh yeah. Uh, they douse it in gasoline, then they light it on, they push it down, and they threw a match over, and so anyways, I'm going down, and the fire, if you don't know, when it gets, when gasoline gets by fire, it gets bigger, 
But anyways, um, yeah, basically, when that happens, it starts to spread around the chair, which then leads to me turning to get away from the fire, which then it learns, which then causes me to spin and get more on fire. Anyways, but obviously everybody's having their phones out. They're taking Snapchat videos, and I don't remember saying anything. But all you can just hear is me just screaming, "Oh shit! Oh shit!" and "Oh shit!" But anyways, um, something hits me, and something hits my head, and I just go out. And so obviously, I I think I woke up. I think I gained conscious a couple of seconds later. Because then all, I look up and she's I'm like, oh, hey, this guy's white. And I realize, oh, wait, I'm plumbing to the ground face first. So if you don't have physics work, if I land face first, my head is going to be gonzo. Bye-bye, head. And so basically, um, the belts were off. I don't know how. I think they actually snapped in half. And so anyways, I push up and I jump. And I hit the snow, and I realized that there was a burn mark through my shirt. And so, basically, then I am just like, well, crap. So, anyways, we get back to the cabin, and my nose feels weird. And turns out, um, I don't have a picture, but my friends took a picture and showed it to me. And my nose, so you know how your nose usually goes straight? It was pointing, like, um... It was po- it was going like right, which if you don't know is not good. So I I think I just knocked it out of place or something. So my friend who owns the cabin goes, "Hey, my dad's a doctor." Grabs my nose and just and just yanks it the other way, and it hurts like hell. It was worse than childbirth. And if ladies, I like I know for some odd reason a bunch of. A, most of my, um, most of my, uh, accounts that watch my videos are adults, which I kind of find that weird. Now I say that out loud. Kind of like giving childbirth. Or for men, getting kicked in the balls with high heels on that are all, that have, that have, like, cleats underneath the high heels. Yes, you heard me right. So basically, my nose is, like, red. It's still some, I think I, I actually have a scar on my nose. It's, like, more kind of on the left side in my nostril, on the inside of my nostril, which is kind of weird. But, uh, yeah. And so, anyways, I get home, and my mom's like, oh, your nose is a little red, sweetie. I'm like, oh, yeah, but we were playing outside in the snow. I hit a tree. I hit a tree. And that's why my nose is red. Moms, if you're listening to this, never trust anything your kid says, except for if he, except for if he's masturbating. And you always got to trust that. Anyways, anyways, guys, that's gonna be the end of this video. Like, like, and subscribe, or else you'll get like, like, and subscribe, or else you'll get someone pregnant and they won't be hot. But if you do, you could still get someone pregnant. But this time, they'll be hot. Um, I don't know why. I'm just wanting the like the gameplay to end. Come on, come on, just ten more seconds. Boom, boom. Oh, oh, look at that sexy swimming mechanics. I don't know why I'm still talking. Ooh, e, pa, 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 che, che,